at this point in postpartum, I'm just welcoming the grandma crotch because I'm literally wearing a diaper 24-7. So let's just ignore that. But most mornings when baby girl is taking her morning nap, I can get a little shower in and a little bit of me time to do my little routine in the morning. Also, y'all recommended firming cream, and I got this one because it has no smell for baby girl just in case if it touches her. Um, But we are going to be doing our little morning routine. So this morning, Gabriel's over, and he's like, do you want me to take your clothes off? And I was like, bro, it's been two weeks. What are you talking about? Like, don't wake up a mom trying to sleep in the morning with that. But he was like, no, you are soaking wet. Like, you are, like, wet. Are you okay? Like, is something wrong? I'm like, no, bro. I literally have the worst postpartum sweats. Like, I knew y'all told me about them, but I didn't know they would be this bad. So, every morning, I feel so gross. Like, I feel like I have to wash my hair and just, like, lather myself in soap because I just feel so gross from, like, sweating all stinking night. But what's crazy is, is I am cold. Like, I'm cold, but I'm sweating. Also, baby girl needed her bink bink, so we had to go back and put the bink bink in. And then a lot of you guys had some questions on this thing. My hospital gave them to me. They recommended me wear them for the next few months. And honestly, it's personal choice. But I do feel more secure with it on because I feel like all my insides aren't going to fall out, you know? But to be honest, birth, postpartum, all of that is super humbling. Like having people help you change your diaper, help you put your binder back on. You can't even go to the bathroom by yourself because you need some help. Is honestly the most humbling thing I've ever went through. But that is just my little morning routine. I also take my prenatals and my little Nutrafol for my hair. Hope you guys have a great Saturday. Love you. Bye. Bye.